It's the heartbreak no family ever wants to feel, the loss of a young child. To see that baby laying in that casket hasn't even had an opportunity to grow up. You know, his life has ended because of some people putting stupid things on various sites. Barbara Williams Beach says her nine-year-old great-nephew, Latarius Smith Jr., died last week after taking part in a deadly viral trend. It wasn't until later on that we found out that um, there was a uh, uh, some type of video on TikTok, you know, letting kids know, you know, how to, uh, what is it, uh, strangle yourself, but you got to get out of it. The challenge is to get out of it. But he's nine years old, so how was he going to get out of it? The game is known as the Blackout Challenge or Choking Game. It involves social media users intentionally choking themselves until they lose consciousness and recording the entire incident. The CDC says the trend has been around for years. In 2008, they released their first study on it, warning about the dangers of the game. Despite the obvious risk and years of warnings, children still die from it every year. At least three minors died in the last four months months alone after their families say they tried the game, including 12-year-old Joshua Holiosis of Colorado, 13-year-old Nate Squires of Massachusetts, and now Latoria Smith Jr. of Memphis, Tennessee. Our nine-year-old nephew, I mean, he's gone as a result of this, and uh, the family is just devastated. A spokesperson with TikTok says dangerous challenges are banned from their site and they will remove these videos if they see them. Now, Latarius's family is warning others not to let any child use social media without adult supervision because this little boy filled with joy. John Legend, <laughs> all of me love all. <laughs> you always say that to me. <laughs> now leaves behind a family overcome by sorrow. TikTok's policy requires users to be at least 13 years old or older, but cyber experts say it is hard for social media companies to enforce these age limits. In the past, TikTok has banned users they've discovered don't meet that age requirement. Aaron.